Hi guys, just going to do a quick help file for you to show you how to put a rubber tyre on a CD. Um, I've seen quite a few versions on YouTube. Uh, latex gloves, balloons, uh, what I'd call rubber gloves, washing up gloves. These are nice and thick, or compared to the latex glove they're nice and thick. We'll start off with a latex glove, quite simple, just stretch it over, and there you go, job done, rubber tyre. Um, obviously you don't want all that hanging out, so cut it off. Now if you want to get more than one tyre, you want to do more than one wheel, you might want to cut this into strips first, but this is the quick and easy way. And these latex gloves are pretty cheap. So there you go, latex glove. I could just see if I can get a second one over the top. Give us a double thickness. From experience, these latex gloves tend to tear as you're doing this, so it may not be the best idea that I've got, but we'll give it a try. Nice. No, it's, it's actually tearing as I'm doing it. So I would suggest if you're going to use latex gloves, use one glove per wheel. It's just enough to give you a bit of extra grip. Right, we take that one off. See if we can use a balloon. You need fairly large balloons to do this because obviously they've got to stretch around the outside. So let's see if we can cut one. I've done these in the past and I've tried to get two or three wheels out of the one balloon and that tends to end in failure because you make them too narrow and if you make them too narrow they're too difficult to actually stretch over the CD. Try it and you'll see what I mean. So I'm just going to make one, one tyre out of this one balloon. And there we are, it's quite wide. Okay, so that's using a balloon. And the final one. So say these are slightly fish, thicker rubber gloves that you use for washing up, or somebody uses for washing up if they do washing up. Okay. In fact, what I'll do with this one is, is rather than just cut it off straight away, I'll do the same as I did with the balloon, and I'll cut it into a strip. We got one on there. Let's see how many we can actually get. So say so don't cut them too thin. If you cut them too thin, they still work, but it's much more difficult to get them onto the wheel because they tend to slide off. like I've got four wheels or four tires there and let's just try this one I 
There we go. So I quite like that because that's slightly thicker rubber so it's going to be a little bit more robust, last a little bit longer. There you go. Help file finished. Hope that helps somebody.